police tactics and verbal abuse increasingly violent. On Monday, as police in Hong Kong attempted to clear the largest of pro-democracy protest sites, violent clashes broke out between police and protesters. The largest of the protest sites is in Admiralty, near the city's government headquarters, and where student protesters had seized control of the street close to the government buildings. Police used batons and pepper spray to push the students out, driving them towards a bridge used for the Admiralty Center Mall. Police occupied the bridge and shouted insults at the students, flicked boogers at them while one officer gave them all the bird. Police say that protesters are also increasingly confrontational as frustration rise, often baiting police with insults and bring it gestures. On Monday, Hong Kong police held three press conferences in under six hours, during which they announced that four officers had been injured by protesters and police had confiscated weapons from protesters, such as knuckle dusters. Conversely, 40 protesters were treated for injuries at nearby hospitals. There have been 50 more arrests this week, which brings the total to more than 200 since police began clearing sites. Extra action, extra insanity, extra perversion, extra mayhem. Tomanews.net.